the RNDC raises two or three critical matters. One, that number one benefited from celebrity endorsement because he was seen to have taken pictures with the President of the Republic and that he went on a trip with the Minister of Tourism. Ladies and gentlemen, since when, since when have members of the public and stakeholders, local, international, been barred from engaging democratically elected presidents and their governments? Is the NDC telling us that the picture of the then President Mahama and globally acclaimed gay rights activist Andrew Solomon in bed meant that your Mahama is gay and that indeed your Mahama endorses homosexuality and is actively lobbying for homosexuality in Ghana. The evidence is there. Lying back together on the same bed. On the same bed. So, can I competently conclude on the logic of the NDC that your mama is gay? Needless to say, Nam One is a matter of public record. He has visited several eminent persons in this country. Anybody who cares to know knows that he has visited several serious people in this country as a responsible political party supporting a very focused government. We will not stoop so low as to suggest that public officers, religious leaders, traditional leaders, and others who by virtue of their office are public property deserve to be abused for dirty political ends. And the NDC is advised that the people of Ghana are wise to their political ideals and will not accept abuse as a form of political communication.